Previously, we explored dynamic routes with the parameter in square bracket syntax, which allowed us to create routes with a single variable segment. But what if we need to handle routes with an unknown number of segments? Consider scenario 4, where we are building an e-commerce app. When users want to view a product, they might arrive at the product details page through different paths. From best sellers, from featured deals, from search results, from recommendations, or from a direct product link. While the product details page content remains the same, having different URL structures is beneficial for three reasons. First is SEO. Search engines can better understand the product's context. Second is user experience. URLs reflect the navigation path taken. And finally, analytics. You can track how users discover your products. Using what we have learned about dynamic routes, we might think we could create separate routes for each pattern. However, this would have two major drawbacks. First is the arbitrary depth. Imagine a list of topics is stored in a CMS or a database, and the depth can change over time. We cannot predict the maximum depth of our navigation tree and create files for each level. Second is code duplication. Whether you are one level deep or 10 levels deep, the UI for displaying the content is the same. If we use multiple levels of dynamic routes, we would end up with a lot of files and folders with similar code. This is where catch-all segments comes to the rescue. Catch-all segments in Explorator is defined using the spread syntax inside square brackets. This special syntax tells Explorator to match any number of path segments and capture them as an array. Let's head back to VS Code and implement a catch-all product details page. In our products folder, we will create a new file with square brackets and three dots in its name. Square brackets, three dots, and let's call this rest.tsx. This tells Explorator that this is a catch-all route segment and rest is the parameter name. The component will be similar to the product ID route we created earlier with one exception. The rest parameter is an array of strings where each element represents a segment of the navigation path. So let's copy the code from id dynamic route, paste it in rest.tsx catch all segments route, and make the necessary modifications. Let's call this catch all product details. We destructure rest from use local search params, and the type of rest is an array of strings. For the JSX, I'm going to render the text, catch all product details, and then details about product at rest.join forward slash. We are basically rendering the path in the UI. Next, in our products slash index.tsx, we will add links to demo the different navigation paths. I'm going to paste three links. The first href is products, bestsellers, PlayStation 5. The second one, products, deals, Black Friday, PlayStation 5. And the final link, products, search, PlayStation 5. I also have the text to reflect the URL path. With this implementation, our app can now handle any navigation path to the product details page. The rest parameter will be an array containing all segments after slash products. Let's test it out. In the terminal, press R to reload the app. Navigate to Products, and now we can see the additional three links. Click on PlayStation 5 bestsellers. We see catch all product details and details about product at bestsellers slash PlayStation 5. Go back, click on Deals. We see the same route again. And the final search link, we see search slash PlayStation 5. The catch all product details page will render the same content, except for the path segments, of course, for all paths. And this works as expected in the browser too. Click on products, bestsellers. We can see the URL is bestsellers slash PlayStation 5. We see the catch all product details. Go to deals. We see catch all product details. Of course, the URL is different. And search catch all product details. As you can see, Catch-all segments allows us to keep the same product details UI regardless of the navigation path. It also helps maintain SEO-friendly URLs that reflect the user's journey. And 
It also allows us to handle any number of segments in the path without creating separate route files. Catch-all routes are perfect for a variety of use cases. We have category navigation for e-commerce sites with product categories that can have varying depths, file explorers for navigating through folder structures with arbitrary depth, organizing charts for displaying company hierarchies with departments, teams, and individuals, and content management for displaying content from a CMS or a database with arbitrary depth such as blog posts, articles, or documentation. The key advantage in all these cases is flexibility. You don't need to know the exact structure of your navigation in advance. The catch-all route can handle any number of segments in the path, making it perfect for user-generated or dynamically structured content.